everyone and welcome back to my channel. One, two, three. So for today's video, we've got another haul. Would you believe it? My next video is also a haul actually and this haul is in collaboration with Aurelius Fashion. Guys, what is my life? Like how am I getting opportunities like this? So all of these were sent to me by Rebellious Fashion and this video is in collaboration with them. So I've got a big pile of clothes sitting here. I'm also sitting on one of the labels. Um, I filmed this haul a bit different to my others. So normally I show you the item and then I go and try it on and then I talk again. That takes me ages to film, ages to edit and makes the video really long. So we've done it like Hannah Renee style. I've tried all of them on already and now I'm gonna, I can tell you what they're like before actually doing it, do you know what I mean? So rather than like a first reaction now, I can actually be informative. I don't know how many pieces I have here, I'm not gonna lie, like 10 maybe. We've got tops, dress, skirts. I do have a discount code, I'll leave that on the screen now. Make sure you guys use it and shop in the link down below. But without further ado, let's, let's get onto some clothes, what you're all actually here for. So first thing I got, is this big black ruffle skirt. If you have Instagram or like follow anyone, these were really in in like summer for like festivals, which is weird because obviously normally people just wear like mini outfits, but I thought it was really, really cool. So it's just got this huge waistband here, which is like big and elastic. And then it's not actually 100% what I thought it was gonna be, but it's still really nice. So as you can see, it's got all the ruffles and then it has the midi skirt underneath. So you can see where the midi skirt ends, which I mean, that's probably how they're all made, but I just didn't think. <laughs> I thought it would be like more full. I don't know. But yeah, I have absolutely no problems with this. I think it's really, really lovely. It's really like extra. I just paired it with a little black bralette. I think that would make such a cute outfit for going out. Pair it with trainers and a little bag and then it likes really casual or you could literally pull it on with heels and like go to prom. I feel like you can do anything with this. Like you could literally go to prom in it, go to get married in it. You could go to festival in it. You can wear it to uni. I feel like this, how you pair it is really important but as i said i feel like with a bralette and trainers this could be a really cool night out outfit at uni because it's like a little bit like all extra but like with trainers and like a bright bag i feel like the bright bag will make it more fun rather than like glassy and going out -y. i don't know fun for like a little bit more dressy night and then i'm not a hundred percent keen on the way i styled this but i just wanted to try it so i have this pink midi skirt it's like a silk one that you like put through a hole and then tie around. So I paired this with a cropped jumper that's black and pink leopard print. The pinks are exactly the same, but the jumpers are baggy, so I feel like it doesn't really work. But I wanted to wear it with a jumper because I feel like these are so in at the moment. But in to not be cool in, no what? In to not go out in, like with heels and whatever, but like in to like just look cool in and just like wear whatever. So, oh, my fairy lights. Oh, you can't really tell anyway. <laughs> yeah, but I feel like these are really in to, like, pair and look cool, like, not to go out in. So I wanted to pair it with a jumper to try and get that vibe. But as I said, I don't know if the jumper I picked worked really 100% well. I'm going to go with a black jumper probably next time. But as for quality and stuff, these two skirts are amazing. Like, I have absolutely no problem with them. Absolutely problem, no problem with the sizing, with the quality, anything. I was actually really, like, pleasantly surprised at Rebellious Fashion. Because I've never actually ordered from there, so I really didn't know what to expect. And because their website's like other people wearing it, it's like, hmm, girl, are you playing? But no, they're not. If you know me, if you've watched my channel, if you just know me, I've got this thing for blue. I can't do it. I don't like blue. I don't suit blue. I just don't like it. But because these were all like gifted to me, I was like, you know what? Just try it, because I don't really actually try it. So I stayed in my comfort zone, but out of my comfort zone, and got some light blue, baby blue cargos. Now... These trousers are sick, can't fault them, sick belt, and they've got these big pockets here at the side, which like have, and again, another buckle on it, and they come like this, just hanging, and the model on the website actually has it hanging as well, both sides, which looks proper sick, but again, I just don't know about blue. I might have to pick these up in black though, because I actually can't find my black cargoes, and as far as cargoes go, these are sick. The quality is so nice, they're like really like thick, and they're that type of material where like you don't have to iron them. <laughs> These are straight out of the bag and they look absolutely fine. Like they're because they're that type of material. I don't know. I just think they're absolutely sick. Again, but I don't know about the colour. Although I did try it on, as you'll see, with like a little bralette. And I think it looks sick. So I think I'm going to try and pull it off for my next night out. With a black bag and black shoes, try and tone it down. I think it could be a vibe. I then got some tops to just pair with jeans for like nights out. So that it's really simple and casual. But 
<laughs> fun story i've actually been tired in the last two days with an allergic reaction i've got rashes all over me i don't know what it's from so i literally had to take we think it's my washing powder so i literally had to take everything i've washed since i've been here and rewash it like rewash all my bedding all my towels everything so the trousers i wanted to pair all these with were in the wash i just had to pair them in blue jeans i'll tell you what i wanted to pair each one with this one first this is my favorite thing of the haul this top is the nicest top i own like by far i think it's incredible i absolutely love it when i seen it on the website it's actually molly may wearing it and i was like mm, don't know but oh my god it's so nice it's so like sexy but still like covered up because it's got big sleeves should i just should i just show you so it is again you probably won't be able to see this very well um off camera but it's just like a little crop top it's got these big lace sleeves which are also puffy and then it just ties into a tiny little bralette at the front and it is honestly the most flattering thing on because the puffy sleeves give such like a square neckline but then it comes like sweetheart where you tie it gorgeous like i absolutely love it by far my favorite print of the haul probably like one of my favorite things on wardrobe at the moment i absolutely love it i wore this on a night out two nights ago or whatever on saturday didn't realise I didn't actually take off the tags. I've just done that now. I, oh, I just love this. I paired it with... If you've watched my Nasty Gal haul, if you haven't, why go watch it? I paired it with the black, like, flowy trousers. They're not flares. They're literally just kind of, like, straight. Um, I paired it with them, and it looked amazing. I absolutely love, like, obsessed with that top. I think it is beautiful, and it is so, so flattering on. I then kind of got a similar vibe, and as you'll see in the trial clip, I can't decide if you meant to wear the top like this or, like, off the shoulder. It looks better off the shoulder, and the sleeves fit off shoulder, so probably off the shoulder. But it's just this little crop top, and the front is, like, completely jersey material crop top. And then the sleeves are these gorgeous, like, polka dot, again, puffy sleeves. This puffy sleeve situation is very in, isn't it? So I wanted to jump on the bandwagon and get them too, because I don't have anything of the sort. So I wanted to join, okay? And as I said, it's just polka dots. And then it has a little elastic one in the middle as well. So it's like, boom, and then boom again. I just, again, think this is super, super cute, super flattering on. Uh, again, I don't have any problems with any of these. I'm always like, oh, this fits a bit weird, this fits a bit weird. But because I've already done the trial clips, I can tell you how they fit. And everything fits great. Actually, there's one thing that doesn't fit, but I'll show you that in a minute. I then, oh my god, I forgot about this one. This one is like my second favourite. This top is so beautiful as well. The necklines on these tops are just so beautiful. Like, at the moment, I'm loving a cute neckline because I love to put, like, shimmer all over my chest. And then I'm like, Ooh. I'm also really pale at the moment. Sorry about it. But it's this gorgeous silk champagne top. So as you can see, again, it's like the slightly milk... Is it milkmaid style... Sl <laughs> that was the ugliest face. Milkmaid style, like, sleeve. Just, you know, the little cute puffy ones so as you can see the top's got little cups here and this sleeve and it's got two panels as well which make your waist like it goes which is amazing again the thing i love most about this is just the neck line oh my god guys so obviously the sleeves make it very square because they're like very near the end of your shoulder and then it just comes down and into like really low into this like sweetheart Guys, it is stunning. I literally felt like Hannah Renee in this. I absolutely love it. And the colour as well. It just looks so expensive. And I'm pretty sure it was like £15 or something crazy. I just honestly think this is one of the most gorgeous tops I own. Besides the black one. Rebellious Fashion actually smashed it, not gonna lie to you guys. And then the last one that I paired with jeans is actually a cute little cardi. So let me do it up and show you. So, it is just this literally, as I said, cream cropped cardigan. The people on the website had all styled this super, super cool, so I wanted to get one and try it out, okay? I just thought it could look cute. And you'll see on the try and clip, the way I like this most is undoing the top button and leaving it like off the shoulder cardi, like with a little bralette underneath. I feel like that could be such a vibe. I feel like that's cute. So that's the way I like to wear this most. Again, not itchy, nothing wrong with it. Nice, thick quality. Obviously, it's a bit like holy, so like it might not keep you insanely, insanely warm, but it is still really thick. It's just like a cable net cardigan brown buttons i love it with the jeans i had on i feel like that was such a cute little outfit for uni because it's still like cool cool if you have it like off the shoulder because it's a bit like oh like cardigan gone sexy but it's still like super casual and super comfy which i love so i got that one and then last top and then i have trousers and a dress i got this newspaper top so it is literally this long sleeve newspaper top it comes down in a v at the front and then it has two little ties that you tie at the back which like snatch your waist in which i absolutely love again i think this top was so cool and so different i've not seen anything like it and it's long sleeve so i can wear it on a night out and not freeze to death 
while I wait for like two hours in Leeds because apparently that's a thing here and you have to queue for clubs. If you're like me, comment down below if you just don't have to queue where you're from. Like we have one, oh, you can't even call it a club, it's like a, a lively bar and you will never ever, ever queue, ever. Like if you're queuing, like what is going on? We have one pub that you sometimes have to queue for in Broadstairs, but that's on like crazy occasions. But anyway, <laughs> that went off on our own page. This top, I love it. So, so different, but really cool. I just paired it with black joggers because I feel like that's a really cute, casual, comfy outfit for uni because the top's still really different and cool. And then the black joggers just make it really like cool and like street. I would have paired it with my black combats, but I've lost them. <laughs> I wore them on a night out and I broke the chain. I have the chain. I don't know what I've done with the combats. I literally can't find them anywhere. I thought I washed them, but they weren't in my wash basket or anything. And I definitely didn't leave them in the washing machine because, like, they're big, I would have noticed. So, I don't know what I've done with them. But that would look cute as well with a chain and white trainers. That is so cute. Why have I lost my back cargoes? But, yeah, that is the last top I got. I think it's super cool, super different. I just really liked it. This was the first thing I picked out on the website because I just thought it was proper sick. And then, this was the first thing I tried on and was meant to be the first thing I showed you, but... Somehow it made its way to the bottom of the pile. I got a little dress. It's like a little, again, like, is it milkmaid? I was about to say mermaid. No. Milkmaid dress. It's just got that similar neckline and cut to that champagne top. So it has, like, little tie-ups at the boob. has little booby cups. And then puffy short sleeves as well. Again, no problems with this. Fits amazing. Looks amazing. No, no worries. I did get a 10, so it is quite big on the chest. But... I'm between an 8 and a 10, so you just got to take that risk sometimes. But with dresses, I'm normally a 10, so it's probably a little bit big on the top half, but if you've got boobs, as I always say, you'll be fine. Or if you're a little bit taller, you'll be fine. But if I put it down, my nips come out. So, but I mean, like, I can still wear it. It's absolutely fine. Just if someone literally yanks it, my nips will come out because the sleeves are elastic. So... Either way, I love it and I will be wearing it, so no stress. I'm gutted about these. Um, turns out I accidentally, accidentally got them in an 8 when I'm a 10. Sometimes I can squeeze, but these these come up small. If you get these, size up. Even 2, because I don't think a 10 would fit me in these either. But I just got, is it PU? Just like faux leather leggings. Again, they're a great like style. Like You can tell they'd be nice and high-waisted. The waistband is great. Like That is not going anywhere. Like it literally has no stretch in it i couldn't get these past my calves because as i always say i'm not an eight on the bottom which is surprising that i've told them at eight i probably just clicked the wrong button but yeah these do not fit but i absolutely think they're gorgeous and i really want a pair of leggings like this so i'm gonna give these to my flatmate <laughs> first come first served girls if you're watching this who wants them but yeah i'm gutted about these because i feel like these would have been so cute with like this top or even like a clash of textures and materials with like the silk top I think they would have been super cute, so I'm glad about them. I will probably just try and size up and see if they fit. So, so that is everything I got. I can already tell this haul is going to be quick because I've only been filming for 16 minutes. And normally I film for about 25. And then I film like a minute and a half try and clip each. So by that logic, this should be a quick, quicker haul. And hopefully you guys have enjoyed it that way. Let me know down below which haul you prefer. Do you want me to try them on for the first time with you? Or would you rather me just sit down and talk about how they actually fit? Let me know. Because if you like it when I try it on with you, I might just do like Amisha Grimes and just literally try on each outfit and then talk about it. Rather than trying to talk about it and then talking about it again. I'm rambling. <laughs> if you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up down below. You guys seem to be loving hauls at the moment-ish. So I've got another one coming on Sunday. It's Saturday or Sunday. It's a Boohoo haul. Again, Boohoo sent me clothes. What is going on there? But again, as I said, use my discount code. And use the link down below. Go and shop Rebellious Fashion. Let me know which is your favourite piece and which piece you would buy. What are you going to pick up? As I said, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a huge thumbs up. Follow me on Instagram at MeganShawXX to see some of these pieces styled. And yeah, I hope you have the best day ever. And I'll see you next time. Bye.